So if you guys are looking for some cheap FIFA 20 coins, head over to u7buy.com. You can buy coins off the website. You can also buy players. So if you wanted Messi, you could buy him off the website. Make sure to use code MUZ at checkout for 5% off. Yes, lads, and welcome back to another video. So today, EA released some content, boys. Happy days. They finally released some content. We've got a flashback Theo Walcott. And by the way, this card design looks absolutely mad. It's like completely different to what we usually get. Um, but just for this time, if you could drop a like, we'll go with 30 likes, boys. Drop us a if you're new. And let's have a quick review. With these cheapest methods, I usually do a quick review. So looking off the bat, obviously, card design. I don't know what to think. I'm, I kind of like it, to be fair. I do kind of like it because it's very different. I, I like it. Um, but looking at his base stats, obviously, he's 5'9", medium, medium, 3 star, 3 star, which already is just turn off for me. That's a big turn off. Um, I don't like that. 3 star, 3 star. But if you guys like it, then fair enough. Um, but his card looks absolutely... To be fair, looking at his stats, he looks absolutely sick. 96 pace, 96 acceleration with 96 sprint speed. Obviously, pace is huge. He's agile. His, his dribbling stats are insane. Good composure as well with good finishing. You'd probably have to boost his finishing a little bit more, but this car looks absolutely unreal. If you had the skill was in weak foot, let's say you had 4 star, 4 star. Oh my, I'd do this without even thinking about it. His stats look sick though. I imagine he'll still be decent, like very decent. But um, anyway, let's jump into the car, boys. There's three different segments for this. We'll have a look what packs you get back. So you get a 30k pack. You get a don't have a clue and a don't have a clue. Apologies, boys. But yeah, premium mixed players pack, small red gold players pack, and a rare election players pack. So we're uh, jumping into the first one, boys. You are going to need a few Premier League players for this. So you need min one Southampton. So we went with Vestergaard. You need minimum one Arsenal player. So we went with uh, Kolasinac. And we went with... Um, Pickford for our Everton player because uh, it needs to be an 83 rated with 70 chem as well. So we went full um, full Premier League for this. A lot of them are very cheap. So in goal, we've gone with Pickford, boys. We've gone with Otamendi at right back, Socrates at centre back, Vestergaard, Kolasinac, Juan Mata, Sigurdsson, Jorginho, Gundogan, João Mantinho, and Torreira. So, um, boys, if, you, um, if you've got any like 82 Premier League players, obviously you can maybe take out Torreira if you've got an 82, just whack him in. Chemistry is not too much of an issue, just if you've got a Premier League player. You could probably even put any 82 up top, to be fair. You might not even need Torreira. Just go with any 82, like, untrade with that you've got in the club. So, uh, there's the first one done. Like I said, you get a Primex players pack back from that. Jump into the next one. I think you need, yeah, you need a team of the week for this one. So, the team of the week I went with is this guy. I'm not going to pronounce his name because, uh, yeah, don't really need to say why. But he's fairly cheap, boys. One of the cheapest team of the weeks currently. So, he'll go in there. Um... And the rest of it will go with Syria. So Syria is very nice and cheap. So um, the rest of it, you need an 83 rated team with 75 chem. So I went with Buffon in gold, newly 83 rated, cheap as out. Romagnoli, Rugani, Acerbi, Mkhitaryan, Lucas Leiva, Biglia, Paul Lopez, Edin Dzeko and Quagliarella. Um, you could either go with Quagliarella, however you say it, or Milik, whichever one's the cheapest. I'm pretty sure Quagliarella is currently cheaper, uh, but whether you're sniping either either one of them, you can get one of them cheaper. So it doesn't matter for Kevin, stuff like that. So uh, there's the next one done, boys. Nice and cheap, that one for the Syria. And you get a small rare gold players pack from that. And then once again, boys, I think I went Syria again for this, because Syria's just the, uh, it's, yeah, I went with Syria again. So you an 85 rate for this, boys. So I'm pretty sure this is going to cost... 85 rate with, mm, I'd say minimum 200k. I, I'm I'm kind of sort of accurate with uh, with my price predictions. It's going to be around 200k, maybe 150. I'm not too sure, but um, an 85 rate team. Yeah, I'd say maybe 150k actually. 150, I reckon. Um, but um, here you need an 85 rate team, two English players. So the two English players I went with, this is big. This is a perfect link, obviously, with James Milner and Henderson. Um, it is an 85 rate team, so. It's very tough to do without like a, a highish rated. So I went with as low rated English players as I could. So I went with Milner and Henderson. They may cost a little bit because obviously um, English players are going to go up a little bit in price. So um, there's there are English players and the rest, like I said, Syria. So Syria is going to be nice and cheap again this year um, for 84s, 85s, and 86 and stuff like that. So we went with Syria going goal. We went, we went with Ilicic at right back, Benucci, Devry, Skriniar, obviously Henderson, Pjanic. James Milner, Luis Alberto, Edin Dzeko, and up top we've gone Immobile. I've checked all the prices, boys. Nice and cheap. This should be one of the cheapest methods, honestly. If you guys are watching this maybe a day or two after, prices may have gone up a little bit because imagine, like, let's say even 20 people use my method 
um, obviously players will go up in price then. So um, if you're watching this a few days after, maybe try and you could still like use this as like a concept, but maybe swap a few players out. Like maybe take out De Vries and um, you could m move a few players around if you get me. You you'll be able to find some different alternates. But uh, this right now, if you're watching this early, this will be nice and cheap for you boys. So uh, there we go, boys. Let me know if you guys are going to do him. Personally, for 150k, would I recommend doing him? I personally wouldn't do him for 150k this early on in the game for a three-star, three-star player. His stats look insane. It's so annoying that they haven't... Even if he had just four-star skill moves and three-star weak foot, I'd consider doing him, but not a chance of doing him. Um, not a chance. But um, anyway, boys, let me know if you're going to do him. Please do drop a like, drop a sub if you're new. And yeah, boys, I'll catch you in the next one. Peace.